Hey everybody, uh, thanks for tuning in. <clears throat> I mentioned previously that I'm really, really, really sorry. I intended to, to do lots of posts this month. Um, month as a magician, it's, I think the month has gone over. But I've just been so busy, which is good. Um, but I've been too busy to kind of organise recording of stuff. Um, so, <clears throat> just going to go over roughly what I've been doing the last month or so. You've probably seen, uh, hopefully you've seen, that I've got a release coming out with Kieran Johnson, or Kieran Lefevre, as he's now known. Uh, we're producing some magic, which is going down very well. Um, and I've been making some things for that, and we've been organising the filming. We've been recently to the Magicians of Facebook convention, which, is, which was fantastic. Uh, that was up in Bromsgrove, in the Holiday Inn. And was basically a uh, hundred magicians all getting together over a weekend and there were some lectures and workshops on the Saturday and then on the Sunday was um, the dealer's day we were selling stuff on our stall. Kieran had a lecture and in a bit I may show you the, um, the entrance to that lecture because I was part of that entrance uh, where everybody dressed up in onesies. <coughs> Excuse me which is good fun. Um, Kieran's a very different magician and uh, very exciting and uh, enjoyable to watch. So his lecture was brilliant. Uh, so I'll be taking some of his magic away with me and producing it and, and performing it for hopefully some of you guys. Um, so yeah, I've been producing this, uh, this magic for some, some people. It's going down very well. I had uh, about 50 orders and then we've got some exclusive deals with some, some stores which is really really good uh, we just got to find some people to help us out in the production of it uh, because I mean this started out basically <clears throat> as something that I was doing for myself and Kieran was, was doing for himself we started getting some good feedback from other, other magicians who wanted to, to do the same things that we were doing and, and it's grown from there so all, all good news um, talking about the lecture I had the very Big pleasure of meeting Mr. Wayne Dobson. I don't know if any of you remember Mr. Wayne Dobson. He was a renowned, well, <laughs> that's him now, absolute classic. These are some of his uh, notes. He was famous in the 80s. Uh, you probably, if you don't know the name, you might know the face. Famous in the 80s and, and uh, 90s, I would have thought. Um, magician on TV, um, did live at the London Palladium. His, his lecture at the convention was just amazing. So, so good to be part of that. Um, and yeah, I picked up some, some lecture notes from him. Um, lots of really cool tricks in there. And there. <laughs> and there. So I'm going to be quite busy. So I've got those uh, from the lecture. And the other great thing um, about the convention was that I had the absolute pleasure of meeting some people that I have been conversing with on Facebook. There's a secret group on Facebook called The Chaotic Group. And here is my badge, and I'm very proud to be a chaotic minion. A chaotic minion, what is that? Well, The Chaotic Group it revolves around Kieran's DVD, which is called Chaotic, but in the Chaotic group, which is a private group on Facebook, there's, I think, 75 members, probably only 20 of us chat properly, almost daily, to each other. And a Chaotic Minion, what is that? That is basically, we use different types of magic, like flash production you've seen there. Um, we do stuff that's that's not run of the mill, unusual magic. I don't want to give too much away because if you see me perform, you might be expecting it. Um, but that is a badge of pride, almost like the magic circle, really, to me, because that sets me aside from what I would consider a run of the mill magician. That, if you knew what that was, you, you'd realize that um, it's a bit like the metal militia gang uh, in the motorbike world. Um, that means that I'm not just any magician, I do break the rules and I do do some unusual stuff and I have fun and I make sure that all my audience have fun. not saying that most magicians don't do that, but um, that is a stamp for me. And I'm going to wear that every time I perform and uh, that will remind me, I think. And so if you ever see that, 
you know what it means now. Um, what else? I got my equity card, which I'm very pleased with. So that means that I'm fully insured up to ten million pounds. Uh, so if ever I borrow a ring and I damage it, <laughs> you'll be fine. But it's never happened yet. Trust me. I'm sure you'll be absolutely fine. Um, that's what I've done. I oh, met up with some guys in London that, that I, I, I think you, you, you've seen. <clears throat> and uh, yeah, Ravi Mayer, um, James Brown. Some really cool guys. So I've been busy. Excuse me. <laughs> I'm going to talk about this. Kind of like a mini review, but this guy here, I've never heard of him, Steve Della. He's quite well known apparently, um, but I mean, relatively new to the magic world, I, I'd never heard of him. But I met up with a guy called Lee Hathaway, who I have, have heard of. Um, and he's quite a big influence really in the, in the way his approach, Lee Hathaway, and, and he recommended this DVD. So I, uh, it's a two set DVD. I took a I took a punt, as it were, uh, an educated punt, given that Lee is involved in this, and it's brilliant. If you are a magician and you haven't got this, get it. It's got some brilliant routines in there, brilliant ways um, to approach people, different ideas on standard stuff. Um, but also, it's quite a good insight into restaurant magic, and uh, there's some, it's called work and play. The work disc is all about work and different routines and approaches and things like that. And the play is all about um, practicing, doing flourishes, card springs, that kind of thing. If, you, um, if you're a beginner, I would still recommend it if you're a beginner because there's some great stuff in there. But if you've never done any magic before and you, you won't be familiar with a lot of the terminology in there, um, there is some great magic though that I would definitely recommend that. So I've, I've been watching that uh, a few uh, evenings and I've been making my pens and I've been meeting up at Hitchin, I've been to Wham, um, I've done some gigs and Roots Brasserie, I'm doing that the next one on Sunday the 3rd of November. Got a few parties coming up, I had lots of inquiries so it's looking good for the Christmas period. If you do want me uh, over Christmas, please get in touch because I'm getting booked up. So if you do want me to come along and entertain your guests for an hour, hour and a half, two hours, whatever it may be, then please get in touch because uh, dates are filling up. Um, and that's it really. I'm gonna do some more magical stuff and post up some more magical stuff. People have been requesting it, some performances. Uh, oh, um, I'm entering, uh, oh no. No, I better not say that. <laughs> Watch this space. Oh, I better, no, I can't say that. Okay. Um, so, thank you. Thanks for watching. I am officially a chaotic minion, which I'm very proud of, and typically chaotic. Thanks for watching, guys. Cheers. Bye-bye.